It's all right, though. Okay. Wolf versus Jago. I don't think anyone likes fighting Wolf, but excellent neutral jump there for the overpower. Punish. Medium. The wind kick didn't hit, though. Oh, I would have just done it again. Should have just done it heavy after that. Here we go. Get the back dash. Short combo. Overhead reset. Nice. Another one. DP. Oh, no. He probably tried to. Ooh, nice little combo. Get a lot of life back. Overhead reset. Go be able to get a little bit more. No punish. Oh no! Got hit with it. Yeah, he does like to end up with sweep a lot. Dan letting these uh, whiff overpowers kind of go unanswered. Kind of huge for Alex Moonfang, actually. Oh no! I think he tried to backdash. Nice punish. Well, not even punish. He was trying to walk away, I think. Oh, the legs finally get clipped after so many hamstring attempts. I don't know. Dan's just walking back. Definitely, I don't know, if you're trying to play that mind game, just just jump at Wolf if he's going to be charging overpower on your when you're knocked down. A nice sweep. Yeah, there you go. You got it. Here we go. Our power again. We block. We get the punish. Any fireball? Yeah, he's been doing a lot of sweep too. It's a very good button. I don't like Marvel Dan going for the light light. That just blows out your KV so much. Like, remember it's on the hamstring, you know it's going to be a punish. You only got to do one. Yeah, big heavy break. Hamstring, yeah. That's very telegraphed. Nice anti-air. Gonna get some life back. Ooh, the throw whip. He could kill. Yeah, throw reset will do it. Well, not reset. Just combo into it with the stagger. The wall bounce. Wall splat. Safe. No DPs. Oh, he did it afterwards. The classic, like, you miss your moment and you just want to do it again. Nice sweep. DP trade. Yeah, that'll do it. Watch out for that hamstring. You know he wants to do it. There we go. It finally gets one. Or gets it. Ooh, yeah, plus frames. He's like plus two. You do have to challenge them to stop them from just doing it over and over again. I like the attempt. That means he, he he's thinking about it. Sweep, overpower, plus frames. Try to do another one. Four frames, not fast enough. Nice little manual into the ultra. Dang, got the second game. Ah, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, cannot join us. I travel in wolf. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, we can get you invited to the lobby after this set's over. Perfect. Okay, light DP getting out. Another end of Kukin. I'm not sure if I like the swap to Shago so much. Shago probably still just fine against... I mean, he definitely beats Shago, I feel like. But, uh... Or at least I would think. He's just uh, the more solid character overall. Yeah, I think his mix-ups definitely give Shago a lot of problems. Mm -hmm. uh, Jago does have a little bit of damage on him, especially now, but... 
But wait, the zoning is really here? a problem. <laughs> wait, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, exactly. To be fair, Dan's not really been using the, the 27 that much. Although, you know, his, this more patient play style is definitely working out for him. There's no reason to uh, go for a risky thing like that. Exactly, especially against Shago. He'll do it himself. <laughs> okay, there was one. Didn't come out. I don't know why you do light DP, but... I know if he's jumping, obviously, you know, sometimes the angle is more beneficial, but... If it's in pressure, right. I don't know why you just don't do heavy all the time. I'm not a Jago player, though. I don't understand these things. <laughs> my mind has out my warp by the 27. <laughs> That's all you can think about. Ooh. Cute little confirm, but it's going to be breakable. Oh, no, he locks out. Alex Moonfake has definitely been falling victim to all these manuals that Dan likes to do. Oh, no, I mean, DP. Yeah, he got a lockout. He's definitely... Dan's not really been getting the uh, the anti-airs with the DPs too much. That should be Ultra. Manual for the, just, uh, you know, just because he wanted to. Got a little manual in there. Just to make sure. Yeah, just to make sure. It's understandable because if, if it didn't put him into Ultra, that was a Shadow DP. And it's like, eh, feels bad. 